Yes. Well, 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 this is our first annual Insane Poetry TV video blog, the first one. Got to give a shout out to the LSP, I hope y'all can see that. LS, throw your L's up, you know, get your L's up, get your L's up. You know what I'm saying, Insane Poetry, that's how we do it. First video blog, uh, you know, wanted to touch on a few things, you know, to stop, start everybody off and stuff like that. My name is Psycho, Insane Poetry, I'm dropping the name Psycho. For the simple reason is because there's a million psychos out there, and there's uh, only one insane poetry. You can Wikipedia that or Google me. I suggest you Google me so you can get some info and history on it, brother. But at the same time, let me give you some updates on what's going on, what's cracking with the insane poetry movement and the whole LSP squadron and all that stuff like that. As far as I go, I got a new project dropping here at the beginning of August. It's called the Best of Insane Poetry. Basically, this is going to be accompanied by a mixtape with your pre-orders. When you pre-order, the uh, Best of Insane Poetry is going to give you four new songs on it also and when you pre-order you get a full length mixtape also so you're pretty much getting two albums for the price of one um that's only going to go out with the pre-orders with the mixtape it's called creative destruction it's very uh it's just very energetic and me just killing you know killing some shit on it but um First of all, I wanted to address some things. At first, uh, I, I get hit up a lot on Facebook and a lot of different other uh, social networks asking, what's up with Insane Poetry? You know, when you're torn, when you're doing this, when you're doing that, what's up with the snuff reels, the Sutter Kane, and all that? And basically, right now, we had to, we were going to put snuff reels to the second one out, had a picture cover and everything. We we're going to put that out uh, right away. We we're starting the pre orders on that, but. Uh, DJ Bless, Sutter Kane had um, some other opportunities that came up, so what we did was push it, push the um, release back for a little bit, so still be on the lookout for Snuff Reels too, um, if anything changes prior to that, I will let you know, this is a video blog, my first one, it's actually going to be one of a weekly thing that I do here, so on that note, you know, I want to talk about some of the things I'm going to be doing you know, with uh, Insane Poetry, what I got coming up here. We got, on June 30th, we got the Brother Lynch Hung Show at the Roxy Theater downtown off Welton. I will be doing a full set there, 20 minute set, uh, pretty much at the Lynch Show. You know, go down there and come down there. And uh, if you're in the area, please come check out Lynch. You already know how he gets it in. If you haven't seen his show, you're in for a treat. He plays a lot of his old, older shit, and then it's like really banging along with the newer stuff and stuff like that, Dinner in the Movie, uh, uh, the second album, Coat Hanger Strangler. Uh, he's got, he does a lot of old stuff too, so it's going to be a good set. Uh, you come down and check me out, you're going to have, you know how I get it in, I rock. So, I mean, anybody that's seen me perform, they know what it is. I go there and I tear the motherfucker stage down, but that's neither here nor there. That's June 30th, so please come check that out at the Roxy, Brother Lynch Hong, Insane Poetry. You know how, to get, how we get it in. And after that, dude, I got something going on really at the gathering i'm waiting to hear back from the gathering but basically a slot looks like you know i might be able to get on the gathering i'm going regardless uh so y'all see insane poetry at the gathering but uh definitely the slot is uh what we're just waiting to hear back from right now uh to do that i'll be out there doing a lot of networking a lot of uh, chopping it up with people, all the fans out there. This is basically, this video blog is basically for the Insane Poetry fans. You know, all my fucking people that are fans. I don't care if you're Juggalos. I don't care if you're, you know, you, you backpackers, whatever it is. I've accompanied a lot of fans over the time. Shout out overseas to my people overseas. Uh, Japan, uh, Netherlands, um, Germany, Australia. Much love to all my peoples over there and all that holding me down. And uh, here's that should be in sometime in August, the gathering. Um, not sure, uh, but if you're going to the gathering, be sure to check out LSP, Insane Poetry. I know uh, Scum will be there, and I'll be there also. And uh, Northside Ninjas, well, one of them, uh, Hex Rated. Shout out to Hex Rated. Um, actually, what else we got coming up here for Insane Poetry? We got a two day event, uh, July 13th and 14th. That's called Gore Fest. Gorefest is really an annually done um, concert. Uh, we've started to extend it for two days now. That's that's being thrown by 
uh, lyrical snuff productions along with strong uh, uh, strong survive productions the whole promotions actually and um, slow pain records so it's going to be pretty good we got the ROC from blaze your dead homie he's going to be in the building of course all the LSP acts mastermind myself uh, smalls one dark half leaders uh, we got a uh, hopefully a flatline set I know there's going to be a death for toll set with true and fiasco so I think that's going to be there too also they're going to do their probably their last uh, show together, you know, as Death Foretold, and um, should be a real awesome weekend. I got my boy JP the Hustler coming down from Grim Reality Entertainment. He's gonna be on the bill. He uh, he's also rocking with us, and then we got um, pretty much a lot of the local Denver acts is gonna be in the house too, doing some things. So you know, shout out to Slow Pain, D Jangles, big shout out to uh, uh, Benzo Spade. And then the whole staff over there, Dana was cracking, you know what I'm saying? So, got to give them mad love. And uh, once again, you know, the LSP people that will probably be with me. Scum will be on tour um, at the Lynch show. So, I'll have, should have my boys, True Killer, Drastic, holding me down. And uh, Mick Fleazy and, and, and Be Nasty probably will be there in the building too. We're going to get it in. So, other than that, man, just want to give you some updates on that. Now, as far as insane poetry, you're getting ready to hit your city and tour and do something. We're setting something up and setting something up here in September. It's me, myself, mastermind, uh, my boys, leader, the leaders of the loss, and you know, we'll figure out what is going on from there. But the tour is going to be actually called uh, Legends of the Fall. Be sure you come check me out. I'm going to be in your city, just getting it in. So. Be sure not to miss that because I'm always going to give you your money's worth. And plus, I got new merch, new CD dropping, all that other stuff like that. So be sure to check me out sometime in September. And actually, I got a mini gathering going on in September too down in Texas and Amarillo. So be on the lookout for Insane Poetry down there to all my Texas fam out there too. You know what? And um, basically, I want to touch bases one more time on some other things like um, I get hit up all the time about collabs. You know, how much it collabs and everything like that. Uh, right now, my rates are definitely gone up uh, a lot, actually. So, you probably want to hit up my management. And you can hit up my management at horrorcrunk at hotmail.com. Ask for Tommy Chavez. Uh, once again, that's horrorcrunk at hotmail.com. Dot com actually yeah and just ask for Tommy Chavez hit him up with what you what you're looking for what kind of concepts if you need booking for shows uh, collabs actually you know appearances anything pricing is going to be a, a certain pricing so definitely if you're serious about your projects and all that then hit me up because it, you got to invest money into your project so um, if you're a serious artist, definitely go ahead and hit my man Tommy up and he'll get you hooked, plugged in and we'll go ahead and knock some stuff out. So, and I got some upcoming projects that I'm pretty, uh, pretty excited about right now, you know, so towards the end of the year, I got this new project is going to be called Edgar Allen Holloman. That's basically letting you know the state of mind I'm in and where I'm writing from and all that stuff like that, you know, uh, they want to say I'm you know, gave birth to horrorcore, or uh, my man e Esham gave birth to horrorcore, or, you know, uh, Gangsta Nip gave birth to horrorcore. I think we all had our all our hands in the nut that gave birth to horrorcore. So, the bottom line is, I want to shout all them dudes out right there, man, but th this, my, my album is inspired by all this other shit, because I'm not like nobody else, and the artists that I respect are not like anybody else that do what we do. So, you know, Edgar Allan Holloman, pretty much, you, you get the message of where I'm coming from. Dark shit, that's, you know, where I'm coming from with that. And then I got a couple of EPs I'm doing. As the people already know, I've got a lot of songs with my man Scum. We got a, a group we we're going to do called Unstable, but we think that, that, that name might be licensed by somebody else. So what we're going to do is change that up. And drop that record here coming up in 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 the uh, in late 2012 or pretty much the beginning of the new year. And then I got the EP. You know, I haven't came up with a group name, but me, Drastic, and True Killer. We're gonna put some heat for that ass, like some you know for the MCs out there. We got we got something for you right there. We haven't put the motherfucking uh, the uh, the nuts and bolts together on it yet, 
but it's going to be something hot. And then I got my man out there in the Bay Area, uh, Killer Gabe 916. Shout out to your bro, bro. You know what it is. We got an EP we're doing right now called, uh, you know, Violent Music. And that's what we're going to come with, with with that, man. So on that note, for the first Insane Poetry video blog, Insane Poetry TV video blog, I like to give a you know special shout out to all the people who help contribute to making this shit happen. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my street teams out there, uh, Jessica, Genevieve, and all the other people who do insane poetry work within the city of Colorado or state of Colorado, shall I say? And and in the in the in the city of Denver and, and the surrounding cities. And shout out to all my fans and all my people who actually street team for me in different states like that. And I wanted to go. Out and tell you, if you haven't found out where to purchase any Insane Poetry music, you can go to Gorehop or www.gorehop.com and that's all LSP product and I have merch there, shirts um, and all kind of other accessories. Go there for your music, you want to hit iTunes, you want to hit any digital online retailer, I'm pretty much on all of that. Uh, Amazon, CD Baby, you can get physical copies through CD Baby. Um, you can reach me just to say what's up at my Facebook, uh, www.facebook.com backslash Insane Poetry, all that shit. Follow me on Twitter, uh, Insane Poetry. Um, I have a Fan Bridge account. Please go join that. Fan Bridge is really kicking off. I can get at you and you guys. Who's on Fan Bridge is the people that's going to get all the discounted rates and all the, the good product before it hits the shelves and everything like that so you guys will get all the bonus stuff and find out about vip passes to certain shows and how to get in and and all this other stuff like that so i wanted to uh tell you, you can hit me up on google plus too that's another place you can definitely catch me at i'm on there a lot so anyway other than that shout out insane poetry we're in the building lsp peace see you next week